right, we just arrived in Cozumel. And we're gonna go check out Cozumel. Avenue? Yes. Going towards down to Cozumel to take the ferry today. It's another nice hot sticky day <laughs> to fly out of Carmen. I found my car baby. Yeah right here. Shop shops. Shop until you drop. This street's actually really long. It must be a couple of miles. Or it feels like it, yeah. It's Fifth Avenue here. And we've never been to the other side yet. So much shopping to do here. A lot of restaurants, a lot of souvenir stores. Actually, a lot of high end shops too here. Alright, this is the dock that you take the ferry to go to Cozumel from. It's 450 pesos round trip plus taxes, but we ended up buying them from one of the vendors. Cost about five dollars more a ticket round trip, but it was better than waiting in the really long line to get ticket. Thirty bucks round trip to go out to Cozumel and back, and we're gonna go check out Cozumel. on the ferry and ready to go to Cozumel. As you can see, it is pretty full. It is Saturday, but everybody's wearing a mask and following the rules, so here we go. It's a little too dangerous to be out walking around on the boat. Dude, these swells are really big and this boat is a rock and all over the place. Hey, babe. Yeah, I am right now. A little 360. We just arrived in Cozumel. This is the dock area. And we're gonna go check out Cozumel. A whole bunch of people trying to sell you rental cars and scooters. And everything you never know you needed. There's the downtown Cozumel area. Alright, let's go check out downtown Cozumel. So we're gonna go check it out.
the beach with a beer, drinking beer. Like a beer on the beach? On the beach. And look how people are pedaling. A little the paddle bowl. bikes. What else? Oh, they look at that. They have a little jump adventure thing that you can go and play with. You can go there and play with that. Or you can. Uh, be a really nice day club here. The, the sand is so soft and the weather is so nice. You can even just see the fish right here. I can't wait to go and take my clothes off and go in the water. This is the lunch menu here at Mr. Sancho's, and it's sort of around American prices, but it it looks good. It's a nice resort. All right, so the first thing we ordered was the calamari. It was a giant order, cost eight dollars, and came with a little bit of tempura vegetables on top, and pretty good, yeah. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Okay, let me. Wow, so many fishes around us. Just hanging out. Oh my god. My we're surrounded by fishy. We're playing with the fishies. Oh my god! I think it's one of the scuba diving boats going back here. A little too adventurous for us, but just hanging out right here is a beautiful, beautiful spot. We've been hanging out at, what is this called, Carlos? What did you find? Oh, I was just doing a little uh, snorkeling. No snorkel because I didn't bring one. And we found a little bit of a coral reef out there. I wouldn't call it a reef, just uh, some spots of coral, some brain coral, some fish to go look at. Nice, we have the it's fish really, next to us. Really fun day here. This... I'm glad we talked to the taxi driver and he told us a good suggestion to come here. Yes, the name of this place is El Sancho. El Sancho. And normally, when the cruise ships are here, they're doing excursions to this place. But since there's no cruise ships right now, it's 
you just sort of come in and pay a la carte and we have lunch and a couple drinks and it costs us 100 or 1600 pesos uh, plus tip because we're nice people and it was a great experience so from Playa del Carmen we took the ferry was $30 each a little less and then $10 for a taxi ride here and $100 well, that's a great day in Mexico <laughs> and it's a beautiful beautiful place Here is Cozumel in the night and we are going to the ferry. Our night is ending here, we're going back to the hotel, we had a great day and now we're gonna go to eat and sleep.